What's up guys? I hope y'all doing good because I'm doing good myself. But anyway, I'm about to start my first let's play on my let's play channel. On Mafia 3. Let's see how it is. I have heard good and bad things about this game. I'm not really sure about it. People say it's good. People say it's not good. People say the storyline is really good. People say the gameplay is trash. I don't know. Let's get into it. Let's... <laughs> Let's see what's really about to go down. And I think I'll make these videos about 30 minutes apiece. At least try. modern city with traditional southern values. I underestimated how far he was going to go. What he was willing to do. Visit the historic French ward and enjoy local cuisine at one of our <coughs> five-star restaurants. <coughs> Killing them wasn't enough. Lincoln Clay was using them to send a message. Or spend the afternoon in the bayou and take in its natural splendor. Sal Marcano had no idea what he was going to unleash. New Bordeaux. Safe. Family oriented farm. Make it your next vacation destination. This city survived the War of 1812, the Civil War, and God knows how many hurricanes. But when Lincoln Clay went after the mob, he inflicted more damage than all the wars and hurricanes combined. I'll try my best not to talk through the cutscenes. Lincoln's mother abandoned him in 1947, a couple of years after he was born. His mother, I heard she was Dominican. I always figured his father was white, maybe even not Italian. Not that it mattered. Back then, if you look black, you black. Famous today, I suppose. He stayed at the orphanage until... You look black. You're black. <laughs> well, when did you meet Lincoln Clay? 1966. I was running black ops out of Laos on behalf of the CIA. He was loaned out to me via joint CIA DOD task force. He's a quiet boy. Good boy. Two purple hearts, the bronze star, and the distinguished service cross. He served his country with honor and distinction. After the city closed the orphanage, he fell in with Sammy Robinson. Sammy ran the black mob over in Delray Hollow. I can't say I approve, but often colored boys didn't have a lot of options back then. Boys like Lincoln, the ones who've been abandoned, they're always looking for a home. Always looking for a place to belong. I think he thought he'd find it in the army. Thing is, once that's lost, you never get it back again. When he returned from the war, Lincoln ended back up over at Sammy's. Now, Sammy owed the Italian mob a whole lot of money. And he needed Lincoln's help. The Italian mob. <laughs> it breaks my heart. Boy, you know. I'm probably about to, be, I'm probably about to die, like, as soon as I step my foot on whatever I'm about to do. Oh my God, it's not thing even... I ever heard. Using real money to rob the feds. Well, hell, man, not like this is our cash. This all came from Scaletta. Scaletta. Besides, peanuts compared to what we're gonna haul out of there. Is everything we need to burn? Yeah, that's it. I grabbed the keys to the truck, then we can get the fuck out of here. Pick up the 
team. Oh shit. So we can get the hell out of here. Okay, Sprint. Still not sure about leaving him like this. He came through mm -hmm. with the truck just like we asked. Mm -hmm. And the his partner to make it look good. Mm -hmm. But you got doubts. Mm -hmm. What does this do? Alright, I don't want him on my back. Get him off. Alright, if I press D, what that do? Alright. Okay. Alright then, that's that. God damn. Um, I was supposed to do that. <laughs> you got the keys so you can drive. Come on. That's supposed to happen. Well, I gotta push the truck having a way to get out. Oh man. Are you gonna tell me how to get out of here? Oh ha, what the man. I'm gone. I'm leaving you. Bruh, it took that long for the truck to stop. Okay. Take it easy heading to town. We don't need the cops crawling up our asses. But anyways, how's y'all day today? Mm. My old man wanted us because, to keep um, one of the guards alive, help throw the feds Probably the slept bed. most of my day. Like you said, probably slept I'll most of it away after getting off of work I yesterday. Learned anything from being over in Nam. Someone's willing to flip sides once, they're probably willing to do it a second time. Oh shit, Fuck I was supposed to turn right there. <laughs> So answer me this. What's the craziest thing you saw over there? You don't want to know. Hell, man, I'm a taxpayer. I got the right to know how my money's being spent. Oh, Georgie Marcano pays taxes. So I don't know. Y'all right, tell me if y'all want me to upload the phone, these and I ain't going to no every, tax every day, huh? every other day. Well, or what other you games y'all want me to play? Yeah. Cause feel free to drop it down in the comments section. The coast of Quang Nai. Evacuating the civvies for I just Charlie go to work and go to school. Day. I don't be having Anybody nothing else to do. Onto a medical ship. Yeah, just let me know. This woman walks up. She's got a baby in one hand and a leash to a pig in the other. Oh. She starts up the ramp and the MP stops her and tells her, you can only bring one thing on board. So she tosses the baby into the water. MP goes to eight. Tell someone Bro, what am I doing? <laughs> okay. You know what she says to him? She uh, says, yeah, I, I look trash already. Jesus fucking Christ. Hey man, you asked. <laughs> yeah, but I thought you were gonna tell me a story about some goop getting his dick blown off or something. I mean, god damn. It's not a fault. But not like you think. What's the evil? Conditions over there, man. Jesus Christ. One day you're raising cattle, tending your rice. Next day everything bombed flat. You put people up against the wall. Oh, they will do what are they talking about? That better been one delicious oh, yeah, I wasn't supposed to be talking while they talk, huh? My bad. <laughs> My bad. That's all I say. They just saying who and huh. That's it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Shit. Truck falling apart just off the. Oh! Yeah, they they really didn't have brakes back then anyway. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm going the wrong way around down the bottom. I'll just leave it. My bad. <laughs> Now let me know if I should cut these videos more, like, like edit them more, cause I'm trash at editing. Have to see if these forged IDs are worth. I mean, I'll do it if y'all want me to, but I suck at editing, so shit might just look even more stupid. <laughs> Back it up to the loading dock. 
some of these fellas might get a little uh, rough with the language and... Well, I ain't like I've never been called nigger before. Nah, I know, but I'm just saying, if I go along with it, ain't no nah, choice. Nah, it's per this person. The only thing I care about is getting our hands on that money. Oh, <laughs> I was pressing Y to get up. It's about to get angry. When I say something about being hot, that's when we make our move. Shut up. I'm trying to shoot some people. Ah, right, here we go. Why you got this big ass gun? I think I'm about to take that back from you. Part of the Boeing crew. The fuck's this shit heel doing here? Affirmative action. You know how it is. Hey, Old country is spinning around a goddamn toilet. You can follow me. As for you, go on and grab those bags off the truck. You'll be carrying them to oh, the cause, room. Oh, because I'm black? Oh, that, all right. All right. <laughs> $8,546. Small bills, mostly. I'll have Miss Gale call up to your office when we're done. Oh, yeah. What they went? They started walking right there? Oh, yeah, you shut up. Let me sprint. I want to sprint. Need to check that scattergun. You packing anything? Still in training. Good. One less goddamn thing for me to worry about. Shut your mouth. <laughs> Buying rooms down in the cellar. This way. I ain't seen y'all around these parts before. Y'all's over in Georgia for a while. <sighs> just got out the service. Who is y'all? And why was that so loud? Was in the Navy for two tours. Got medals falling out of his ass. Government tells him thanks, but no thanks. That's a crock of shit if I ever heard one. Sad day when a God-fearing white man can't get a job. That old nigga who staggers in. Watch your mouth. <laughs> this game funny. Why am I supposed to be burning it? Get out of my way. These bastards better not be playing with each other back there. <laughs> they playing with swords. Christ, look at that. Why am I supposed to be burning this? That yeah, Washington's been shuffling around it's on the counter. Damn war. talking. It's here, and it gets sent to Dallas, and it comes back. Yeah, it doesn't make a lick of goddamn sense. Yeah, we are. Oh. <laughs> Here we are. Throw that shit in that damn thing. No, I want to burn him. I want to burn him. Carried all this shit all the way here. I want to burn it. I guess the job done. Only time there's a problem is when the flu clogs up. Fuck. That's some heat right there. Oh, I did get to kill him. But a year or so back, we switched over to oil. <laughs> Shit, let me just toss him in there. God, that guy was an Toss that thing. Let me toss that we thing in there. Danny and Ellis should be coming up any time now. Just throw him in there. Give me a second. Ah, oh. ah, oh, man. Let me throw him in there. Nah, nah. I'm trying to take care of this nigga. Keep your ass down. I'm trying to put him in there. I know what the fuck I'm doing. Crouch, oh. How you crouch? Oh, okay, I got you. About to boot, boot, beat his ass, yeah. You know that house we've been nope. I don't know. Oh, I, I yank his ass. I yank his ass. Be out in two weeks. Can I just run over there? Name's, uh, John. Starts laying into me. So he wants to see that gun sitting on the ground. That's how he's supposed to find you a new place in two man. weeks. So I tell him none of that's my goddamn shut problem. Shut your ass up. Shut up. <laughs> okay, how you pick up a weapon? X. How you put it up? Let's go, man. This place ain't gonna rob how you, itself. Uh, how you go back to the hand? I want, I want to go. Swap, press, LP. Can't go back to my fist now. Are you for real? Oh. 
Wait, that shit. Oh. Shut up! Shut up! Oh, <laughs> it's supposed to be right. <laughs> My bad. Oh, I hope this combination skeleton got us is legit. I'll be damned. All right, go for it, Godzilla. So now you're trying to call me a monkey. I want the robot. Just because I'm black. All right. I'm going to take it. Holy fucking shit. Watch your mouth. It's beautiful. All right, I'm going to take care of this room. You see what you can get from outside. <laughs> Once these boys punch you with that drill, we gonna start throwing this down. How are we supposed to get out of here with all this? You are done. God damn it! You triggered the fucking alarm? Shit, I didn't know this cage was on a different system. Alright, we're gonna hold off the guards until Danny's done drilling. Hey, we're gonna pull this off. How? You better get out there and start shooting with me. <laughs> oh, a shotgun. Oh, I'll take that. I'm trying to blow some shit up now. Bro, what happened to my... Ah, oh, y'all done goof. My wild dog weapon. Oh, the headshot? Shit, I'll take it. I don't care about you being hit, bro. I'm busting ass. Oh, 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 yeah, I like this. Oh, I gotta go out there. Okay, pick your head. Oh, oh, I heard some voices somewhere else. Bro, I, hit, I knew I heard some. Uh, bro, who got eyes on the stuff, though? Sit your ass down. Oh, shit. Aim assist. Low to high or turn it off. I don't even know what I got it on to be honest. Yeah, we shall kick the harness nest this time. Am I hurt? Why am I shit hurt? Oh, dumb. Can I pick up that weapon? That's the same one, huh? Shit, I don't know. Which one better? Hmm. Wait, 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 wait. Where am I supposed to be going? You know, he, he, he have a hard time with everything. Leave it up to me. You gotta do everything. Yeah, I so did not read that. So I probably won't. Bro, I don't know how to do that. <laughs> I didn't even read that at all. What about that? Another weapon. Can't want the smoke. Wait, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute. <laughs> They're right, they not. It's your fault. <laughs> Little smoke don't mean shit. Stay close to the vault. Watch for the drill. I'll deal with these assholes. How? How, Sway? How? Shit, I wanna oh oh man, I'm so glad they saved me because I was so <laughs> about to get so smoked up. Cleaners and stole the uniforms Georgie Marcano and Lincoln Clay wore on the day of the robbery. Another one was a janitor at the Federal Reserve, and he provided a rough layout. The robbery of the Federal Reserve was timed perfectly, and none of it would have been possible without the involvement of Sammy Robinson. Lincoln Clay and the rest of the black mob. He just got finessed. Couldn't even finish it. You just come from Vietnam? Vietnam? That's right. I was a Marine in the Pacific. You take it from me. Just because you're home? Doesn't mean you're back. You understand? People around here, they don't 
They don't get it. <sighs> Never will. <laughs> Keep your ass out of trouble. I'm late. Got caught up crossing the bridge. Don't worry about it. Excuse me, sir. I'm looking for my stepbrother, Lincoln Clay. You seen him? He used to get ticked off if you were even a minute late. Kiss my ass. There he is. <laughs> <laughs> How was the trip? Me and how this is the first time in four years, and somebody telling me where to go, what to do, or how to do it. It was fucking great. <laughs> Hmm. What's new with the old man? Man, don't even get me started on Pops. He used to pull his head out of his ass. Same as ever then. The whole Brother, head out of his no ass, goddamn. Damn, Ellis. She's looking good. Oh, yeah. Just like I left her. <laughs> man, even I know not to fuck around with your cop. Mm. All right, come on. I'm ready to go home. Mm. Whoa, 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 y'all ain't tell me set the root. Thought that shit was gonna get done for me. <laughs> drop to the bar. I think I'll drop there and then I'll end off the episode. And then make me another one. I don't even know if I should try to make them all. Since we got your uh, telegram about coming home, we've been climbing the walls. Parts, uh, what if the plane crashes? What if the train's minutes. delayed? What if Bruh, get out of my way! <laughs> oh, damn. You know, sip his whiskey like he was expecting you to come strolling up the sidewalk. This car sure does make a lot of don't noise. Say don't about me on. telling you that. I won't. It'll be fine once he sees you. Ever since Mama Hell, you know how he gets. Aw, oh, man. Who who let me miss that damn thing? Oh, this car suck at driving. Is there a D brake song? What's that? Oh, that's a cop. Oh, shit. Police will attack if you commit crimes, act especially a break traffic laws at the end range of. Well, I broke one. Gotta come out for me, guys. Sure. They moved up to Empire Bay years so after you shipped out. Started selling weed. They call this shit like I'm playing for them. Fuck them police. <laughs> Free money as far as I'm concerned. Anyhow, a month back, Marty drops me a line that says they're moving into heroin, that they're looking for a partner down around these parts. Can't imagine Sammy was too keen on that. I never told him about the weed. That ain't nothing to nobody. But this, I gotta talk to him about. I ain't said more than three words, and he's yelling about the feds. How we don't need J. Edgar up our asses, and what the fuck am I thinking? Selling dope with kids running around the neighborhood. We ain't selling no dope to no children. <laughs> like they got any money to begin with. <laughs> Fucking around the side. That was pretty serious shit. A couple guys over in Nam who were running it wound up pissing off the wrong person. Got their throats cut. Shit, man, I know what's what. That's why I'm talking to Georgie about it. There's no way Sal's gonna go along with that. Georgie says he'd keep his old man from fighting out. We'll steer clear of the high low in Frisco, just selling the French wall. Georgie's Uncle Lou won't say shit as long as we give him a taste of the action. I don't know, man. Georgie's a cool cat and all, but heroin ain't the kiddie pool. Us. I bet he'd agree to a three-way split. I don't know. I kind of need to lay low a bit, figure some things out. Yeah. All right. My bad for talking through the little cutscene or little talks that he had. I'll try to stop that. Once you get settled in, I was thinking we could go to this new club in the French Ward. Maybe double dating. Who the hell am I gonna go with? Your great aunt Beatrice? Oh God! <laughs> I ever tell you I accidentally saw her without a shirt once? Oof. That woman has the droopiest, nastiest tits hey, I've nasty ever titties. seen. <laughs> <laughs> they were like two sacks of potatoes with nothing in them. Yeah, like that was a fucking accident. Come on, we're going through the front. I ain't having your wall here. I ask you the back door. Run it down. Run it down.
Look who I found panhandling out in front of the train station. Pleasure, man. Hit him? Well, shit, old man. I finally went somewhere they knew how to cook. <laughs> Welcome home, son. How are you? I'll be better once I get some of that shine in me. I always <laughs> did love corn whiskey. I would like to make a toast. My father used to say that the real worth of a man came from the mark he left on the world. When Lincoln first told me he was joining the military, I was against it. Too dangerous, I say. Let those people fight their own war, I say. But then I realize Lincoln needed to go out and make his mark. And that's precisely what he did. I'm so... so proud of you. Paul Lincoln! Bienvenue à la maison! Paul Lincoln! Bienvenue à la maison! <laughs> good to see you. You're so good. <laughs> nice seeing you, Lincoln. Oh, I kept you in my prayers. I really appreciate that, Father. <laughs> now, who wants to get shit faced? <laughs> Woo! It's hard to explain what it's like coming home from war. Elation, fear. Imagine being trapped in a dark room and there's no way out. And every fear, every nightmare you ever had is in that room with you. And there's no escape from any of it. And then, one day, a door opens, and you're free to go, just like that. The thing is, you made your peace with your terror and your fear of death. And now part of you is afraid to leave it behind. But what choice do you have? Every soldier has to walk through that door one way or another. Man, that whiskey's gonna hoy in the morning. Hell, man, just sleep it off. The room's the same as you left it. I'm gonna take the basement. <laughs> the basement? Why the fuck you wanna crash down there? I'll see you in the morning. Man, that wall must have really fucked you up. All right, I'm back. Um, I kind of goofed the ending, you know. I, I done kind of, um, I done kind of went stupid and didn't forgot to record it. But, anyways, thank y'all for tuning in. Like and subscribe if you want to. It'd be really appreciated. Y'all have a good one.